All right, everyone, here we are with ticker symbol TSLA, Tesla Inc. And before we jump into this chart, welcome to all my first time viewers and investors and my subscribers. Welcome back. And let's see what this chart has to say. So after a very bearish run and honestly hitting lows of about 308, 307 and just recovering from there, it's incredible to see how volatile this could be on its way down and even on its way up. I mean, in the last video, I had stated, could the Bulls continue this run? And I guess they watched this video and they heard me and they showed us that they can continue this run. I mean, this was a significant run here. This wasn't a couple dollars. This wasn't like $20 run. This was literally a $50 run. And it's just very very strong and to the point that they broke through the 50 day moving average and they're significantly above it so let's go ahead and look at the new resistance level and support here i mean there was just one drop of bear in the day and it just slightly leveled off and from there it just continued to kickstart and run i mean it was a great run for the bulls and uh, the bears are definitely trying their best to appear and they couldn't they only appeared one point in the whole day so let's go ahead and look at this low point here when it leveled off and the 50-day moving average before i get started so 50-day moving average is 387.60 see if i can land exactly on it it's not allowing me but 387.60 is the 50-day moving average as long as we stay above 387.60 the bulls are in full health if it breaks through it we're now in bearish territory and the bears are on their way to gain control. But before getting through that, we have our support level and that's 396.78. That's the lowest point in this leveling off and the bearish run had ended and the bulls continued their way up, right? The bearish run was just this drop and they tried their best to level off and they wanted this to go in this direction, but they couldn't do that. And the bulls actually appeared and brought this one up to newer highs. So very great run for the bulls and not allowing the bears to appear and destroy this momentum. But the lowest point here is 396.78. And I'd pay very close attention if the volatility continues in an upward or downward and upward and upward and downward direction. If it gets close to 396.78. I'd pay close attention if the bulls use that as support to recover or do they break through it and then now the bears are getting closer to the 50 day moving average and they're going to do their best to break through it and get into bearish territory. So very, very important 396.78. If that gets close to it or breaks through it, I'd pay very close attention. I want to emphasize that. Because this volatility was great in an upward direction, but if this volatility appears in a downward direction and it reaches this support level, it's going to be something I want to emphasize again to pay very close attention to and see if the bears are gaining control or will the bulls reappear and bring this one back up. After closing at 42708, the resistance level is 42878. That's the highest point this stock reached in this bullish run and it's the highest point that it's reached in the last couple of days and it literally broke through the 426 mark that was very important that there was a slight uh, resistance there that got rejected twice and it continued to hit newer lows so it finally broke through that point the next point that they're going to want to break through is 449 but before getting up there 428.78 needs to be turned into support so that this can continue to test newer highs and work its way up to new resistance levels. Hope you guys found this video helpful and informative and it means you well. Share this with your friends and community. Don't forget to hit the like button and let me know you watched this video. And if you feel encouraged or inclined to subscribe, don't forget, forget to click on the bell, excuse me, so that you guys can turn on all notifications and not miss a single video that I post. Thank you guys so much for watching once again and let's make some money.